Hey guys, Tech Made Easy, and I'm out here with Brooklyn and looking at different ways you can hold up these solar panels, you know, these foldable ones, right? So on the right side, I've got one that's good for like a medium to large panel. And on the left side, I've got one that's good for a small panel. Now in this video, it's going to be pretty quick. I'm just going to kind of put this on a 400 watt Eco EcoFlow solar panel, a foldable one. And then I'm going to put this one on 110 watt and 160 watt so you can see kind of what that looks like. All right, so short review, but here we go. So here's what it looks like. You get a, a carry bag, just a simple carry bag, right, with a strap. And this is what it looks like set up. So I've got one set up right now. I'll show you how it has to get put together. It's pretty simple. Right, Brooklyn? So here's what you get, right? You get the stand. Uh, you get the bottom piece that the panel will go on. They do give you an extra one of these guys in a bag and some instructions. So let me set this up. So you just spread open the legs, push this down, and you'll see here in the back, they've got two clips that'll allow you to raise this depending on how high you want it, okay? So, you know, obviously we're gonna wanna hold the panel at a certain point. So I'll lock it in here, all right? And the next thing that we need to do is really just take this, we're gonna put this in um, position here and let me just make sure I get it in the right position all right so you could see here that you know you got four spaces here four spaces here this is centered and all you do now is use a Phillips head screwdriver okay so we are testing this with a 400 watt panel let me tell you this is not a light panel first of all and you know you almost need three of these to make this work. I don't feel real good right now with two. I might try three and see what happens, but as you can see here, it really isn't, you know, straight, first of all. And, you know, the pole only goes up so high before you, you pull it out all the way. You do want to have, you know, it down a little bit so it's got some strength, because again, this is metal and plastic, right? So, you know, and I didn't lift the legs because these legs go up, but that doesn't, that's not going to help stability. Right, it's got the bracket in the middle, so that helps. I did put it in the center of this panel here, and I did put it in the center of this panel here. Now what I might do now is move it here and see if that works, because I just don't like that it's not straight. So, be right back. So I'm gonna try a third one in the middle, but one thing I did differently on this one is, if you notice, there's a screw here and there's a screw here. I decided to lower this one, and I think that'll allow this arm that goes up to actually hold this even better. So I'm going to change that on this one and that one. Right, Brooklyn? So guys, three is the magical number. All right. Three is the magical number. And um, you can see here that one is kind of centered on the last panel, one is centered in between the two, and then one is again, you know, I gotta move it over a drop more, but take a look at that. I mean, that's pretty straight, you know, for the most part, as you could see, the panel is sitting within the rim here, there, and there, okay? So not bad. Look, I don't think it's the most stable thing. I'm not going to kid you. And I think these were like $35 each, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I believe there's a two-pack. You can get a little bit cheaper. But um, I figured, let me show you this one and the next one on the smaller panel so you could see that. And there you go. I raised this one up and centered it. This one sits in between the two panels, and then this one is in the middle here. And you just kind of lift this up in order to adjust the bar, but you don't want to pull it too far. 
you want to leave it some room so it has a little stability. Again, this is plastic, and I don't know if it's aluminum, I'm not sure. And I didn't raise these, right? There's no need to raise them. I think that would make it more unstable. That's a 400 watt panel. So I picked up a smaller one, and they're called art easels, by the way, for the 110 and the 160 watt panels. I don't know if this is going to work. Okay, this is a smaller one. These don't require any assembly, by the way. You pull these out of the box, and all you do is basically drop it and uh, tilt this up and push that back and you've got a little art easel so let's see what that looks like i'll start off with the 110. so there's 110 watt and i'll tell you if i put 160 on you know you probably would need three of these to be honest with you you know if you want this really straight you're probably going to need three of these you know uh, these are you know putting them kind of in the center that's kind of the best that I'm getting, but I think if you use three, it'll probably be okay, you know, just because you'll get it straight. I'll be honest with you, on this one, you probably might want to use four, you know, because three is doing a good job, but, but what happens when wind comes, you know, <laughs> I just don't know. Brooklyn's ha having a ball here, but uh, yeah, so these are uh, different price. I'll put them, uh, a link in the description, um, you know, but, uh, yeah, you might need three on this one. So there's three, all right? And, you know, if you move these around, too, by the way, you'll, you know, it might help out, depending on if you want it up or you want it down. I found if they're wide across, they help out a lot. So not perfect, but pretty darn good with three on this one. Now I'm going to try the three with the 160 watt and see what that looks like. Well, that's the 160 watt, and it seemed to work well. I did do the uh, angle here, straight there, angle here. But, um, yeah, I mean, you know, it's a little bigger than the 110. But did a pretty good job. You know, sits right in. So, not too bad. You know... Listen, lifting this 400 watt panel into those things isn't easy. <laughs> you probably should have two people. Um, but yeah, so I really hope that this helped. It's something different. You know, if you just want to leave your panels in a certain angle, um, I don't think this is the best angle for a 400 watt. You know, maybe in the morning, depending on where you live. Right, Brooklyn? All right, guys, so, hey, look, final judgment. Honestly, this one seems real nice because it's metal, and it worked well for the 160 and the 110. I felt like, you know, it just keeps that angle, which is nice. This one here with a 400 watt, I'm just not 100% sold. You know, I, I mean, the concern I have is what if you get wind? Uh, so you'll probably have to find a way to get this to, to kind of stay on this in order to keep that angle. You know, that's my main concern. That one's all metal. This one is metal with some plastic, right? You've got some plastic here, plastic here. Um, this is adjustable though, so this one will go higher if you need it to. It's got those clamps that you can open up, but I'm telling you, you're probably gonna wanna keep this low for a 400 watt panel, or maybe a 200 watt panel. All right, guys? So, you know what? If you, if you thought the review was helpful in some way, give us a thumbs up. We'd really appreciate it. If you're new to the channel, take a moment, subscribe, become a member of the family. Brooklyn's here with us, and uh, right now she's just kind of turning her head at me. I don't know what's going on. And by the way, if you want to follow us on social media, you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook right up here. Guys, so thanks so much for your time. Right, Brooklyn? Hi. Hey, guys. Take a moment and give us a thumbs up. We'd really appreciate it. As you can see, Brooklyn, she's waving her tail for you. Take a moment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell and you'll get notified of new videos we come out with. Also, follow us and contact us on Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook. 
We'd love to have you. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day.